So guys, a former defense minister is an NPF Council of Elders chairperson Sidney Sekaramai he sent shivers down the spine of ruling party supporters after he denounced thieves while chanting a slogan. Sekaramai chanted Pasi Nimbava down with thieves at the Uzumba Maramba Pungwe star rally over the weekend but the chant left the ruling party supporters shocked. The slogan failed to get traction in the audience, including those at the top table. Sekramai, who was once touted as the successor of the late former president Robert Mugabe, fell off the party's succession matrix following the November 2017 coup, which saw President Emerson Mnangagwa grab leadership of both the party and government. Pamberi Noku Wina, my elections, passing in Bava, forward with election victory, death to Thieves. He chanted much to the chagrin of the crowd, which appeared very uncomfortable to respond to the chant. The NPF has been accused of normalizing corruption and creating a culture of impunity in which corrupt officials within the party are not held accountable. Political commentator Tendai Ruben Bufana told Newsday that Sekramai's slogan proved that the NPF supporters know the thieves in the party. The NPF supporters are away. As NPF is the headquarters of thieves, and they were just shocked about what Sekramai was saying. Was he shooting himself in the foot? What he said is hypocritical to people who are suffering, Bofana said. We have witnessed that President Emerson Nangagwa has been getting the chairs he expected. People have been doing this out of desperation because of hunger and poverty, as they have been getting freebies. At the rallies. Political scientist Fanny Wakasega says the NPF had normalized corruption and the only way to remove such a culture was voting it out. Sekaramaya's post shows a moral conflict he realized just before uttering his chant that he is a victim of his statement and the entire NPF elite. Even the supporter's response is a clear indication that corruption has been cashnonized in the NPF, he said. The NPF survives on corruption coming to this election. The citizens have a moral obligation to convict such people on the ballot as Zimbabwe Anti-Corruption Commission and the judiciary is proved to be toothless. Several opposition social media sites were celebrating the slogan by Sekramai saying corruption was the elephant in the room. Many in Uzumba, scores of NPF supporters were seen grabbing food from a vehicle at the rally and leaving while Mnangagwa was too delivering his speech. So guys, that's the latest here. In 2018, President Emerson Mnangagwa promised to fight corruption, but five years later, it seems like the man has forgotten what he said in 2018. Yes, he was supposed to even talk about it uh, this year with Iowa. Takasunga on Wakati, on At the same time, Takarikawa Mariakati. But the man is not even talking about it. And so, this is a daily news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince Miller Entertainment TV. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. Remember to like, share, comment, and follow. Bless up.